with this drawing, I'm starting with the same organizational line to just place the object on the page. And you can see I'm using, comparing the width of it to the height of it before I even get into the interior. And now I'm feeling my way around the object, the edges with contour lines, using the, that overhand pencil grip that allows me to fluctuate the intensity of the lines. And you'll notice I'm not, I'm also pulling those lines into the center of the object gesturally so that it's not just a silhouette. Now that will help you interpret the form and, and look at those outside lines and use those to interpret the interior shapes and forms. And you can see I'm starting to um, finish the, the outside perimeter and making just small corrections. And you'll notice I'm using a brush to kind of wait, uh, whisk away some of the erasures, which I, I recommend you doing because it'll keep you from smudging the paper. Now I'm feeling my way around those forms using the outside lines as a guide. And you can do it very sharply. I'm using a, a lighter pencil and fluctuating the line weight to, to uh, describe the object in order to give it a feel of, of kind of fullness and volume.